Did you know you can move to Germany without a job offer? There's this visa that allows you entry into Germany without a job offer. You sponsor yourself down to the country to go look for a job. Now this is amazing. You don't need to write any English language test, no IELTS. This visa has a low requirements, it's easy to meet. So if you're interested in moving to Germany, even if you're not interested, you should be interested after watching this video. I'm going to be telling you everything you need to know about this visa, the requirements, the documents you need to apply, who can apply, what you can do in Germany on this visa and much more so if you're interested in this information then do watch this video to the end for those that are seeing me for the first time my name is Jackie and you're welcome to my channel where I share information to help you relocate abroad to work to study and to leave if you're interested in this kind of content then do subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification bell so you know when I post more videos like this right now on my channel I have many videos about how to migrate to different countries I have videos on how to migrate to the US UK, to the Netherlands, to Ireland, to Luxembourg, to Australia, so many of them. So you may want to check out my videos so you can know your options. Like many other countries in the world, Germany is experiencing labor shortage. So they introduced the job seeker visa to attract skilled migrants to the country to take up jobs. This visa has low requirements, so it's one you should definitely take advantage of. So let's find out a little bit about Germany. Germany is a European country, is a member of the European Union, and it's also a member of the Schengen Zone. Germany is a highly developed and technologically advanced country. There are so many cities to choose from in Germany, and I'm going to be telling you about them as we go. Germany is one country that offers free education on all levels, both to citizens and foreigners. Germany is one of my favorite countries in the world. I absolutely love Germany, and I highly recommend Germany to anyone that is looking to relocate abroad to work. Let me quickly tell you top reasons why I think Germany is a place for you to go. The top reasons for me are the people, the structure and stability in the country, the high standards of living and the opportunities the country offers experts. So let's talk about the people. The German people are easy to warm up to. There's a stereotype that Germans are strict, precise and without a real sense of humor. While there's some truth to this, it's mostly a case of getting to know the people, especially outside the formal situations. If you're from a more laid back culture, the German strictness and fondness for rule structure and time might come across as blunt or even rude. So when you're moving to Germany, it's all about what you say rather than how you say it. The number two thing is that Germany offers structure and stability. Germany is one of the safest countries in the world. You'll feel extremely safe living in the country. Germany has a highly developed infrastructure system as well as an efficient government and law enforcement system. The public's relationship with law enforcement is positive and respectful. Additionally, corruption levels are low, the streets are clean, and the job market is robust, leading to a strong basis for a stable society. Germany's safety, highly developed infrastructure, and and robust economy allow Germany to offer you a very stable reason to move to the country. The number three point is that Germany offers a very high standard of living. The salaries in Germany are quite high so workers live a very decent life in the country and even with the high salaries in Germany the cost of living is lower than other European countries in the region. You find groceries to be so cheap in the country and even the healthcare system is quite accessible at a very low cost and remember I said education is free in this country. So imagine the country where the wages are really high and then the cost of living is really affordable so this gives an average person living in Germany a high standard of living. The number four point is that Germany is great for English speakers. While the official language in Germany is German, you can go by with just English. So you may be wondering if you're going to find jobs in Germany as an English speaker. Most definitely, there are jobs for English speakers. It's advisable to learn the language though, but you can do well with English. It's not one of those countries an English speaker will be lost in. There are a lot of people that speak English in Germany. And the number five point, which is very important, is that experts have great opportunity in the German job market. Germany is known as the economic engine of the European Union. In fact, it is one of the top five economies in the world. The salaries are high, the quality of life is great, and the work-life balance is good. Germany could definitely be your expert dream come true. And the number six point is something I love so much about Germany. There are so many cities to choose from as an expert. 
there's Berlin, there's Munich, there's Frankfurt, there's Hamburg, there's Dortmund, there's Cologne, there's Dusseldorf, there is Stuttgart. There are so many cities for you to choose from and they are all at par. Germany is really amazing for foreigners so you should really consider moving to the country. Now let me go into talking about the visa, the job seeker visa. What is the job seeker visa? The job seeker visa is a long-term residency permit that allows you to stay in Germany for six months to look for a job. And after you found a job in the country, the job seeker visa will be changed to a work permit to allow you to live and work in Germany. So this visa is basically for you to gain entry into Germany for a period of six months for you to look for a job. You're not allowed to work on this visa. Once you find a job, this visa will be changed to a work permit and then you can go ahead and work. To obtain the job seeker visa, you need to do the following three things. Number one, be eligible to apply. Number two, complete all the necessary documents. And number three, fill out your application form and book an appointment. So who can apply for this visa? There are certain criteria you need to fulfill to be eligible to apply for the German job seeker visa. Number one is that you must hold a bachelor's degree or a master's degree from a German German university or its equivalent in a foreign degree. You must have five years work experience in your related field of study. So whatever you have a degree in, you must have work experience for that same degree. Not that you studied one thing and then your experience is in another thing. Number three is that you must show proof of sufficient funds to cover your stay during the time you're in Germany. And number four is that you must have travel or medical insurance to cover your stay in Germany until you get the work permit. So if you meet these four requirements, then you can apply for the job seeker visa. Now let's look at the documents you need to apply. So you need the following documents to attach to your application for the job seeker visa. The first document is your valid passport issued in the past 10 years and valid for at least 12 months after your scheduled return. Number two is a copy of your passport's data page. You also need three passport photographs based on biometric specifications. And you need a cover letter to explain the objective of your visit, how you plan to find employment in Germany, and your alternative plan if you cannot find a job. And you also need your degree certificate and certificate of any job experience you have. And you need a detailed CV, so you need to write your CV. I have a video on my channel that will show you how to write your CV. I'm going to be linking it in the description box below and it's also up here as well. In that video, I have templates and samples that you can adopt to write yours. The next document you need is is your proof of accommodation in Germany. That is where you're going to be staying while you're in Germany. And you also need proof of financial means to cover your stay in Germany. So you're gonna be needing proof of funds to show you have enough money to sustain yourself for the six months you're gonna be in Germany. This proof of funds can be in three ways. And the first one is a sponsor in Germany. Your host is gonna be writing an obligation letter stating that they are responsible for you while you're in Germany. So if you don't have a sponsor in Germany, you can either use your bank account account statement or a blocked account. A blocked account is an account you open in Germany where you transfer your funds to and leave it there until you arrive the country. So those are the three ways you can prove sufficient funds. And the next document you need is the proof of your status in your country. It's either your birth certificate or your marriage certificate or any other document that proves your status in your home country. And then the last document you need is your proof of health insurance. In order to fulfill the requirements, you need to prepare two sets of these documents and take them to your application center. And on a side note, in order to increase your chances of getting this job seeker visa, I'll advise you use a blocked account as your proof of funds. So while you have all the documents listed here, the German embassy in your country could still ask for additional documents, like documents for specific professions like doctors, nurses, teachers. So be prepared for that. The consulate could ask for additional documents. After you've gathered all your documents, the next step is to fill out the application form. This application form will be filled out at the German embassy in your country. After you submitted your forms, you'll be booked an appointment for your interview. So your backgrounds, your documents, your application form and your interview will determine if you will get the job seeker visa. I'm going to be doing another video on how to find jobs in Germany. I'll be showing you where to find jobs, how to find these jobs, everything you need to know about finding work in Germany. I'll be doing a video for that. So watch out for that video. Subscribe to my channel and turn on the post notifications so you know when I post this video. If you found this video valuable, please give it a thumbs up, that is a like, and also share the video with others so they can take advantage of this opportunity. Thank you so much for watching my videos. See you in the next one. All I